Today I'm going to be showing you a hair tutorial for Easter. And it's very simple. Come on. Come on. My dog's down there. Come on, Nick. Give me a Then I'm going to film, next time, after this, I'm going to film Easter makeup. So, yeah. <laughs> and the reason why I'm doing so many today is because I'm going to make up for the videos I barely did yesterday because I thought that so. Even though it's super late. So you're going to want pretty fresh hair. I have dry hair. And if you have dry hair, just comb out any knots or anything. My dog. Okay, he's pretty far. I thought he's closer. <laughs> so I'm just combing it out. And then I also have a brush that just smoothens my hair. So after I'm done with the section, I take it and smooth it. And I also use that as my teasing brush. Buff brush. So you're just going to, and the reason why I have so many knots is because it's because I had school and everything. And my hair usually gets very, very naughty. Ow, I just put this over my eye. It gets pretty naughty after school. And during school. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Ready? One, two, three. Okay. So I'm done. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna part it to the side. To your favorite side. If you're lefty, you can part it to the left. Or if you're lefty, you can put it to the right. And if you're ready like me, you can put it to the right like me. Or you can put it to the left. Um, I'm putting it to the part I usually part it to. And now I'm just going to take my regular brush and run through my hair with it. Okay. So, next thing you're going to do is just smoothen out the hair right here since you just picked up the hair from there. Okay, so I have, okay, the supplies you're gonna need for your hair are the combs. Uh, I should have told you this in the beginning, but a comb that smooths your hair or like just a comb and a brush. Some two little, like medium rubber bands, or two big ones, or two little ones, and a headband. It really depends if you want the headband. If you're going like Easter hunting, you could go ahead, put pop on this. Like just bring it along with you if you need it. Okay. So what you're gonna do with these? Okay. So what you're gonna fart, fart first do is make sure you're getting a good part. And just part it in the middle. Pretty easy. Oh, my baby's sleeping. Not a baby, but my dog. Okay, after you do that, this part has a little bit more hair because of the part. So I'm going to part it down. Okay, so now I'm just going to comb it out very aggressively apparently and then just going to smooth it so if one half has a little bit more and that's the part you usually part it in it's because you um, part the hair and if you want you could part it down and then do this and then part it again but that just takes a little longer doesn't it Okay, 
Okay, Riggs, it's my combs. And I'm not, like, I'm looking at my dog, but not on purpose. I'm trying to call my hair. It's weird in it. And I'm also looking at the TV. Okay, so this is what I usually go to salon. But, um, since it's Easter, you kind of have to go all out. Or holidays. Okay, so you're just going to form the hair into a pig. A pig. A pigtail. And I don't have a mirror, so I'm looking right at the canvas. It might be bad. <laughs> and just do cute little pigtail braids. And if the hair goes over the ear, it really doesn't matter. If it's messy, does it matter? Um, so yeah. It's just cute little braids. And anyway, it's going to get mess messed up if you're going um, Easter hunting. And anyway, if you are like a teenager or something, and you don't really do anything, um, just put, pop your hair into some pigtails and it'll be perfectly fine and you'll be into the Easter spirit and they won't say, hey, why aren't you dressed up or anything? You could just have your hair up like this or and wear like a bunny shirt or an Easter shirt, whatever, and ba-bam, you're wearing Easter stuff. Okay. 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 Okay, so you're just gonna braid it. And this side has to be a couple inches loose for the good effect. And if it's not even or anything, it doesn't matter, like I said. Um, but if, again, if you don't dress, wanna dress up or anything, well, not like dress up costume but like dress up into the easter spirit and then you could do it even or you could do whatever you want with the braids you could even do it a french braid or anything i'm just keeping it pretty basic One, two. And yeah, and then you could take your headband. This is why I'm saying you should take it along. Um, if you're, again, if you're not gonna dress up, you could just pop this on where you don't get hair in your face. But sorry if it was a little bit too far. Then just pop it in. And if you have a cute blue, green, or pink headband, I'm using an orange headband, and this is not even um, Easter color. So, wow, I'm so awesome. We're dying. But anyway, it's not even Easter. But I might even use this hair, um, hair tutorial on Easter day. So, this is, I hope you like this video. And sorry, I was a little bit too far away when I did it. But, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, like, subscribe, and yeah. Baby. Okay, bye.